today. We are here along Middle Sound Loop Road right by Ogden Elementary School. And we are here as a community in opposition to a proposed rezoning request by a developer to rezone 3.35 acres that's right across the street from the school and right on our roundabout. And this gentleman wants to rezone it from R20, which is low density, to R5, which is high density. Our number one concern is school safety. Secondly, we have a huge traffic problem out here in Middle Sound because the area has seen so much development in the last five to 10 years. And Middle Sound Loop Road is a true loop. There's only one way in and one way out. And it also serves the developments in the Wendover area, Wendover, Emerald Forest, and several other neighborhoods that are behind big lots. That is their only safe way to come out and approach the light on Market Street and the light on Military Cutoff Road. So not only do we have thousands of Middle Sound residents coming out and using the roundabout, we also have more residents coming from this other direction and we all come together. And we're just concerned about adding more cars. And if it were kept R20, they could put six houses on it as opposed to 24 three-story townhouses which is the proposed plan. And another thing we're very concerned about is that that proposed development would only have one way in and one way out. And the one exit is almost directly across from Ogden Elementary's bus loading and unloading area. And there, buses beg into traffic in the morning and they make a left-hand turn and they beg into two lanes of traffic. There is no crossing guard at this school there is no crossing signal. We're very concerned about all of that. We have a lot of people that like to walk and ride their bikes around the loop. Another big concern for us, and that we wish everyone would be aware of, is that Middle Sound is located on a peninsula. To one side we have Howe Creek, the other side Pages Creek, and then the Intracoastal Waterway. And we should be concerned about the stormwater runoff that more development creates for those waters. And those two creeks used to be deemed pristine waters but they've been closed for shell fishing for years. And another concern we have is that Middle Sound is home to lots of wildlife. We have, of course, the regular deer and box turtles, but we also have a sizable number of birds of prey, including owls, osprey, red-shouldered hawks, herons, the seabirds too, egrets. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs>